Welcome to the Science Business Network. My name is Richard Hudson and we're in the European Parliament right now. I'm joined by a member of the European Parliament, Martina Werner from Germany. She's with the SPD party there and a member of the Socialists and Democrats fraction uh, in the European Parliament. Welcome, Martina. Hello. Hi. Uh, Hi. Could you, first off, tell us a little bit, I mean, what is your main priority, do you think, in, yes. as a member of the ETRA? Because you are a member of that committee, which deals with research, energy, technology, etc. Yes, it's a lot of very interesting things in the ETRA committee. And I'm looking for the industrial policy and the energy policy. That's my uh, two clear priorities. Right. Yes. Okay. And what? So, and industrial. What? What do you want to do about it? <laughs> uh, I want to. Um, I have a special attention to the SMEs. I think they are the most employees in the SMEs, and we have to uh, to take a look for the development of the SMEs. Right. And uh, there, I will take one uh, special look for this development of SMEs. Okay. So then, on energy, then you said that was also in. In interest, what 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 are you trying to get done with energy? Yes, uh, there's a new energy, the renewable energy. I think this will be a big chance for us to get uh, more uh, um, industrial um, production in Europe, and uh, we can get more employees. Therefore, and bec uh, because that's one of the biggest reasons we have to de develop this uh, en the new energy production, new companies which are growing more and more. Okay, and so uh, is um, I, I, on what the Commission is planning right now yes. uh, uh, in the energy field, are you happy with this? or? I don't really know. I think about the 300 billion from Mr. Juncker, yes, he, did the, he talk the, about the yes, gift for the gift uh, for, <laughs> for, for, for e e economic hope, stimulus and renewal. Yes, yes, yeah. yes, yes. And I hope uh, that we get some money from uh, for the renewable energy. Just to come back to that energy question again, though, mm -hmm. thinking about you said you th you wanted to be sure that there was a good investment in renewables. Yes. Uh, okay. Um, do you what percentage do you see of your going to renewable energy in the future? Hundred percent. I mean, is that is uh, that okay? <laughs> in future, in a long future, in a long way, I yeah. think uh, maybe one hundred or ninety percent. But I think we can do more than twenty-seven percent. And it's very different from each member state to another member state. We have twenty-eight member states and twenty-eight different policies. And, um, but I think we have to put this together to achieve this aim together. And uh, one other uh, issue is the policy, the union policy, energy policy. I think this would be very necessary for us. You uh, mean to complete the market, the single the, market? The single for... complete, uh, single market, market, yes. I think but if you will... do that, then isn't that going to cause a, a problem with uh, your objective of renewables? Because not all the member states have the yes. same opinion. Yes. Uh, uh, so, so, I mean, you know, you will have nuclear coming from France, you will, you know, mm -hmm. uh, uh, fossil coming from, you know, uh, the UK or elsewhere. You know? Yes, I, I think it's a, I think it's one aim. And we all agree to this. Uh, we are to agree to this aim to get for a long way, for a long, long way, the sustainable energy everywhere in Europe. Thank you very much, Mrs. Werner. Uh, it was a pleasure to speaking with you. Thank you very much too. Thank you.